Hey, so Ruthie's desk reviews. Here's another one. This one's going to be quick as suggested by one of my wonderful friends on Facebook, toilet paper. We're going to review Scott's toilet paper. Okay. Let me just start by saying this is going to be super quick because there's not much to it. Literally there's not much to it. So as you find, Remember like if you were a child of the 70s or 80s and your parents were pretty cheap and like trying to save money all the time, they wouldn't buy like the really fancy Charmin toilet paper because the rolls of Charmin are really tiny. They would buy the Scott's 1000 sheet toilet paper. And the reason that it's so cheap and it's 1000 sheets is because it's the thinnest stuff made on earth. It's like, you know, if you buy something from Wish or some generic like uh, thing on Amazon that gets shipped in from a, a Chinese vendor or a, you know something like that they wrap it in this weird thin tissue paper that's what this is look you can see me through it and as my daughter says when you wipe after you go two it's like there's nothing between you and your butt so this is Scott toilet paper now if you have a septic tank this stuff's the bomb. Disintegrates because it's literally tissue paper. I mean, really, a better option for this would be to take this and put it in a gift bag because it's just like tissue paper. Maybe you could dye it somehow, but if you get it wet, it just disintegrates right away. So I'm not sure how you would do that, but it's an option, right? Scott's toilet paper. Number one value brand, value. Here's the deal. It's a value because there's nothing to it. If you get real toilet paper that's thick, there's something to it. And this, you know, I know we had a toilet paper shortage, which is how I got the Scots. But this stuff sits in the, the uh, guest bathroom now because we don't have any guests, thanks to COVID. So, you know, I just, I consider that the pee bathroom only, so whatever. Here's a toilet paper that I like. This is my favorite. And it's not wrapped up in anything fancy. It's not even Sherman. It is Members Mark from Sam's Club. This toilet paper is comfortable. It's thick. It's not too thick. It doesn't clog your pipes in the toilet, not, you know, the other pipes. But I mean, it's, it's great. This is great toilet paper. It's quilted. It's soft. It lasts a while. I love this toilet paper. But you have to have a Sam's Club membership to get it. Um, I'm not a big fan of Charmin because I think it's too soft. And I'm not a big fan of Northern because it's like a cross between Scott's toilet paper and Charmin. And I don't really like Angel Soft, same reason. So when the toilet paper hit, you know, when the toilet paper problem hit earlier this year with COVID, I was desperately trying to find my toilet paper and it was out and out and out. I'm like, who is hoarding my toilet paper? Because it's not like everybody on earth belongs to Sam's Club and could go get this toilet paper. But for some reason, everybody had it. Well, I finally found it and bought two containers of it, which I'm now working through so that I have toilet paper. Anyway, that's more than you need to know. But at any rate, Sam's Club toilet paper. All right, I guess that's it for this video. I'm gonna get to work, but I just wanted to show you what was on my desk and watch for my next exciting episode of what's on my desk so I can review it. And I gotta get this toilet paper off my desk. Talk to you later.